Okay, before the break, I asked each of these two if they thought there was an issue that was outstanding. They said sort of. Um, communication is kind of a really broad sort of thing. I said that I thought there were two that were glaring to me. And so I'll tell you what they are. Number one, permeating everything that I can learn about you as a couple is you have an inability to let things go. There, there's not resolution. You'll talk about it, you'll invest in it, you'll problem solve it, but you don't ever problem resolve it to the point that you can say, okay, we've worked on this and we've, we've finished it. I can close that book and put it up on the shelf. I don't need to take that down and read from it, feel about it, hurt from it, emote from it anymore. It's in our history, I don't forget it, but I can put that up on the top shelf and don't have to get that down again. You don't seem to have the ability to let things go. Y'all don't speak each other's language. You don't speak each other's love language. And there is a language of love. And if you don't speak each other's love language, you could each be screaming, I love you, I love you, I love you, in a language the other doesn't understand and be missing wonderful messages of love. If he is saying, I love you, in a language you don't understand, you could be missing wonderful messages. And if you're not talking to her in a language that she comprehends, you might as well be sitting there staring at the wall. You don't speak the same love language. Now, okay, first off, how am I doing? Have I run a red light yet? You're, you're spot on. You are spot on. <laughs> you're doing a great job. Yeah? We just, <laughs> we just need some help with being able to uh, turn it turn things around. But you agree I'm with what I'm saying? I'm a for life, yes. You agree with what I'm saying? Yes. Okay. I should have my own show. <laughs> yeah. Now, so, so what do you do about this? First off, there's a formula for success in a relationship. It's right here. The quality of a relationship is a function of the extent to which it is built on a solid underlying friendship. We'll get back to that and meets the needs of the two people involved. Now there's two parts to that, and we're gonna take a break, and when we come back, I'm gonna tell you how you can use that formula to deal with these two underlying issues, because I intend for this to change today.